welcome to ethiopia dear prime minister abby ahmed why am i even writing the letter let me just talk dear prime minister for real mr prime minister you cannot say that you've not seen how airport officials treated muslim pilgrims that were going to hajj on ethiopian airline don't get me wrong i like ethiopian airline i've flown ethiopian airline but you know that doesn't mean that we should not address blatant discrimination when we see it this is wrong a business should not be discriminating against passengers based on their religion and you know what if this were christian pilgrims that were treated like this the whole world would be shouting this people's flight to hajj was at 3 p.m they told people to come early those people got there five hours before the flight some of them got there 10 a.m and after they checked in their luggage they said to them that the flight has been moved to 6 p.m they didn't give them any food nothing they told them to go and sit outside they provided a tent for them but some of them were drenched by the rain because there were many of them and then at 6 p.m they told them that their flight had been moved to 11 p.m and they still didn't give them food the whole day they didn't give them food they've already spent 13 hours at the airport too. and then at 11 p.m they said to them well your flight is now 5 a.m not only did you not give them food you refused to lodge them in a hotel people were sleeping at the airport there were so many elderly people among them some of them had trouble walking they had to be helping them from point a to point b and then there was someone that was visually impaired among these people no hotel nothing they slept at the airport as you will see in this video this woman was really upset <laughs> this is not right it's not fair and then at 5 a.m you told them their flight is delayed again by another one hour they ended up spending 20 hours at the airport the whole time other passengers were boarding their flights except those going to hajj and you know the sad thing i found out that this happens every single year when people are going to hajj they discriminate against them their prime minister please get the airline to do the right thing by muslim pilgrims this was not a free flight they paid for their flight and then they were treated like this after paying for their flight no no, no the devil is a liar shame on ethiopian airline has been trending out for days but instead of addressing the issue the airline is blocking people on twitter i was like no are you serious these are your customers <laughs> you are blocking people that is so childish passengers deserve better regardless of their religion or ethnicity or background hopefully the airline will apologize and do right by these people you guys not know much guess what i'm just keeping it wrong <laughs>